No, we when we call a blitz to rush the passer, we try to get somebody free. And there's enormous differences between pass protections. And when you run a blitz, you run a blitz so somebody comes free. You don't know exactly who it is that's going to come free. But you attack their pass protection, and someone in a certain spot's going to come free depending on if a guy misses a assignment or they don't slide far enough. Or a lot, a lot of it is just getting where you get one guy on an edge of a blocker and he can beat him to the quarterback. There's nothing wrong with their protection schemes. You just you influence them with the one guy, and the other guy runs by him before he can rock back. But when we blitz, we don't know who's coming free. I mean, they could spread out and block all those guys off the edge, and then someone in the middle should come free. That's the way it's designed. That's not the way it always works. But I thought Jake played great. And I don't usually give those kind of compliments. I thought that's one of the better games I've seen a kid play. I mean, he played hard. He played fast. He made up plays all over the field. He did. He did what middle linebackers are supposed to do. Oh, I think he's around the ball a lot, and he's and he's uh, he's got a lucky charm. Because he's around, he's around the ball when it gets tipped, and he's got pretty good hands. Uh, he's also a pretty good pass rusher. Uh, I'd have to see the film to see how well he did against the run and all that. I thought there was times we were a little soft against the run, but that was kind of on purpose. Well, I, I thought it was a total team team victory. I mean, I thought I thought that the defense played really well, and I thought the defense gave the offense uh, several short fields that the offense capitalized on. Uh, I wasn't real happy with the very first drive of the game, but after that, the only time they actually scored was when they had a kickoff return down to about our whatever yard line it was, and that's the only other time they scored. They moved the ball a little bit uh, in the middle of the field, but that was kind of by, by design too. I mean, we were playing a lot softer coverages than we have in the past uh, to make them work it down the field. And toward the end of the game, even our soft coverages, they started completing a couple of balls in our soft coverages because we weren't getting a pass rush with four guys. <laughs> I mean, that hasn't changed. No, I, I, yeah, I, I agree with you, though. I, I don't think last week they didn't play the kind of offense that would challenge us. This week they played a lot of spread. I mean, they they got in there and tried to run the ball a little bit, and if they got in second and long or third and long, they were in a spread. Uh, I think I think we have improved a little bit in coverage, uh, but we haven't improved much in a pass rush. I mean, we have to blitz to get to them. Uh, I, didn't see, I didn't see one sack when we rushed four guys. I didn't even see the quarterback harassed very much when we rushed four guys. So that's still a huge concern. I mean, if you can't get a consistent pass rush with four guys, it doesn't matter what kind of coverage you play. I'm, I've been telling you that since day one. I think it all depends on who we're playing. <laughs> I, uh, I think Fresno has a really good offense, but Boise State must have a really, really good defense. <laughs> so I think it depends on who we play. I, I thought our offense ran the ball well, and whenever we run the ball well, guess what? Everything else works too. And when we don't run the ball real well, the other stuff doesn't work very well either. I don't think it's serious. I, I can't tell you it's a knee injury. And they said it wasn't serious. In fact, he tried to move around on the sidelines, maybe even to go back in the game. But he should be okay. I don't know how soon he'll be okay, but he should be okay. I 
I, I thought, to be honest with you, I thought that was our, other than the Army game, which is completely different circumstance, I thought that's the best we've played on defense all year. Because our kids executed the game plan, which was to give up some yards, but don't let them in the end zone. And other than a real short, other than the first drive in a real short field after a kickoff return, they didn't. They moved, They got some first downs and they moved the ball a little bit, but they didn't get in the end zone. 